Hi, my name is Chloe Weaver, and today I will discuss the upgrade and renewal process for SAS contract subscriptions. I will cover upgrade and renewal scenarios, walk through the seller process of creating the annual upgrade or renewal, and walk through the buyer process of subscribing to the upgrade or renewal offer. When are upgrades or renewals needed? A private offer upgrade or renewal is needed when the buyer needs something different than what they are currently subscribed to in AWS Marketplace. There are four reasons to facilitate a buyer upgrade or renewal for SaaS contract subscriptions. First, a buyer may require an upgrade or renewal when they would like new or different terms than their current terms. Next, a buyer may want a different price for each dimension or instance type that they are subscribed to. The buyer would like a new or different duration, or the buyer would like to renew their contract before the existing contract ends. To create an upgrade or renewal offer for a SaaS contract subscription, the seller must create an agreement-based offer using the buyer's active subscription. How do I create an agreement-based offer? Agreement-based offers are created in the Agreements tab of the AWS Marketplace Management Portal, or AMMP, for buyers that have an existing subscription to your SaaS contract product in AWS Marketplace. All agreement-based offers are created with scheduled payments, which requires buyers to be on invoicing terms with AWS. Once logged into your AWS Marketplace Seller Portal, click the Agreement tab. In the Agreement tab, search the active subscription with your buyer's AWS account ID. Once you have identified the subscription to upgrade, select the agreement by clicking the circle to the left, and then click the button titled Create Agreement-Based Offer. Enter the details for your upgrade, including offer name, agreement end date, dimensions and quantity, additional usage pricing if applicable, agreement payment schedule, and EULA. It is important to note that when a buyer subscribes to an agreement-based offer, it completely replaces the buyer's current subscription. Any invoices already generated for the buyer will not be modified when the buyer subscribes. Invoices included in the buyer's initial subscription that have not been generated yet will be replaced with the new payment schedule included in the agreement-based offer. Lastly, Select the option to mark the agreement as a renewal and select the agreement-based offer expiration date. Once the offer has been reviewed and created, allow up to 45 minutes for the agreement-based offer to generate in the Offers tab of your AMMP. Here, you will find the newly created agreement-based offer where there will be a new offer ID and the unique offer URL that can be sent to the buyer to subscribe. How do I accept an agreement-based offer? First, the customer will sign into the AWS account they'll want to use to subscribe to the private offer and navigate to the agreement-based offer. This can be done by either clicking on the private offer URL provided to them by the seller or navigating to the product in AWS Marketplace. Then, the buyer will choose the private offer from the list of available offers and then click Upgrade. The customer will then review the dimensions, payment schedule, and EULA, and then choose Upgrade Current Contract. It is important to note that AWS does not provision SaaS products to buyers. Therefore, buyers must complete registration on the seller's website after finishing the subscription in AWS Marketplace. The buyer will be billed per the payment schedule dictated in the new private offer, and no cancellation of the previous subscription is necessary. The new private offer will replace the previous subscription once subscribed to. Thank you. If you have any further questions about subscribing to SaaS contract private offers, please reach out to mpcustdesk at amazon.com.